Hello everyone, and welcome back to XCraft. This will likely be the last episode uh, in this little quick series we're doing. Uh, there's a chance we could come back to it in the future, um, but I'm wanting to try out some other mod packs too, so there's going to be um, some other stuff coming in the future. Um, but I want to go out on a bit of a bang. So, I've been, uh, you know, pulverizing, I guess, or I guess enriching this iron to double it, and I've been smelting it up because what I want to build costs a lot of uh, iron. I want to build some cars. Or more importantly, or more specifically, like a one of these things, a sofa copter. Um, yeah, and, and there's also an ATV we could build. I, I had a look in this uh, workstation, and there's a bunch of things you can make. You can make like an ATV, a boat, bumper cars, motorcycles, go-karts, little tricycles, which is pretty cheap, but I mean, I don't really know what it's going to do. A dune buggy? That is not a dune buggy. But anyway, um, there's a bunch of stuff here that's pretty cool. There's like a RV, which looks really cool, a Jeep, shopping cart, planes you can get, tractors, and then the tractors have like storage trailers and stuff. Um, you can even get a boat, apparently. Fluid trailer, and then a couch and a sofa copter. Now, the sofa copter actually looks like it's the cheapest. Now, for pretty much all of these, we need concrete. Um, so, we might struggle a bit. I'm also going to get this camo bench, because maybe... Maybe not. I don't know. I thought maybe that would help us change its color, but I assume this is just to put camo on uh, the different armor from that mod. So we're going to need concrete, right? Which means we need concrete powder, which is gravel, sand, and the dye. Um, okay, so what do we need for this? We need red and gray. Let's bookmark these. Red, gray. Um, and then we'll probably go for the sofa copter first. So this will be some red wool, which I guess I'll bookmark. Um, where are we? That's fine. This guy needs white concrete, grey concrete. Oh my god, we need, like, everything. Um, and now these, uh, engines don't actually need much. Uh, in terms of concrete, anyway. Okay, so, wh what is it again? Gravel, is it gravel sand and gravel sand? Yeah. Okay. Gravel and sand. Um, we have a bit of gravel. We actually have quite a bit, and we've got a tiny bit of sand. I don't think it's enough, though. Um, and what do we have in terms of dyes? I don't think we really have any. Um, so I might actually go out hunting for all the different dyes, and I'll come back as I come across each, I guess, flower and stuff, because we're going to need, what, roses for the red dye, bone meal we should have. Um, we're going to need to kill squids, which I believe I saw some this way, maybe, in that pond. Okay, well, I'll, I'll go have a little look. Alright, well, there's plenty of uh, yellow dye, which is unfortunate because we don't really need it. Um, does the black lotus turn into black dye? It, it definitely does. There we go. That's our black dye taken care of. Um, we even have squids, so I might kill some squids just to make sure we have enough stuff. Um, so what's that? Oh, here it is down here. Um, we might as well go for another one. Might as well. Hopefully they don't blind us. Alright, there we go. We have the black dye, which means we have the grey dye because we have the bone meal. So it's just red? Is that all we're after? I think it's all we're after, so i got to find a rose or something. Oh my god, they're just teasing me now. Look at all the yellow dye. Or, I guess, you know, the yellow flow. Ooh, did I see... Yeah, here we go. Oh, I'm lagging a little bit. We can also mine this, I believe. Just in case we uh, figure out that we need to use it for something. Um, and I might get the coal, because we're using quite a bit of it for uh, all this um, iron we're smelting. And I don't actually know what fuel these machines use. So, I don't know if they use electricity or what. Only one flower? Um, I don't think one's enough, is it? Mm, you know what? It might be. It might be... Oh, actually, no, because we need a, we need sheep as well. We're going to need red wool. So, we can either do red sheep, or we're going to have to dye the wool um, that we make from the flax. Uh, ooh! Are they roses? Or are they, like, um berries? I'll go for it anyway. We'll have a look. Oh, here we go. Just to the right. So the roses are over there, or berries or whatever. But I found the jackpot, so I think we're good now. So I'm going to pick up all these, head back, and start making stuff. Now, we might need to do the flax, because, I mean, I don't I don't think I've really seen any sheep around. Um, so I might have to do some farming. Um, which, I mean, you know, shouldn't be too bad, but it probably won't be too fun. <laughs> Oh, wow. And there's some red plants uh, connected to the village. This is the village path. So, there we go. I'll grab it all. I don't know how much we're going to need. But I'm sure that's enough. 
Alrighty, let's see uh, where we're at. So, I'm thinking we do one set of um, red concrete, if that's... Is this how it works? How does it work? Four and four? Yes, so red concrete powder. We'll have to uh, water this up with a bucket, so... Uh, I get, you know, we can actually... Hmm, do I get the bucket or do I just go to water? I'll probably just go to water, right? I think that's fine. Um, next up, I think I do a set of um, white concrete. Um, and then dye them individually. What do you reckon? I'm going to need quite a few of these, I think. Because we need to make... Um... So the first thing is the workstation, which uses light grey concrete and red concrete. So light grey is what? Um, it's going to be black with white gives us grey. And then grey with white gives us light grey. There we go. Okay, so I'm going to need three of those. So I could just do oh, three of them this way, which I think I will do. Okay. Um, next up, we're going to need what? Uh, the gray concrete's for the the actual thing, isn't it? The sofa copter? Ceiling fan. Yeah, one gray and one white. Okay. Yeah, it's easy. That's easy. Um, so let's do this. Here we go. So now we're going to make a white, a set of white concrete, and we're going to see if it lets us turn one of these into grey, but we need to make the grey. So black with white gives us grey. Can we make it grey? Ooh, no. Okay. Luckily, though, we have enough stuff that we can just make another set. Is it a recipe like this? It is. We can just put it however we want. Okay, now, um, I'm going to empty my inventory again, and go and um, get all these powders to be, what you call it? Solid concrete, right? Oh, you know what? I was going to go and find water, but we have water right here. Um, so I might as well use it. So I believe all we do is place the concrete down and it turns into um, actual concrete. So we don't actually have to turn all the white concrete powder into concrete because we don't really need it. Uh, same with the red stuff. We only need four, I believe. We might need a little bit more. I don't really remember. So that's that. We need one gray. And I think, um, what happened to the light gray? White powder, white concrete. Huh? <laughs> what happened to the light gray? Did we not make light gray? I'm confused now. I'm going to have to go look, maybe. Okay, I don't think I actually made it, so we're going to have to make the uh, light gray. Boom, boom, boom. Light gray, concrete powder, perfect. I think we only needed one bit of powder. No, wait. Was it three? I think it might have been three. Um... Boom, boom, boom. Three. Okay, I think we can start crafting it now. Um, do I have some of this on me? I think I'm going to need some redstone as well, so I'll hold this too. And hopefully that's... Oh, I think I need some wood, because I believe there's some recipes that need pistons. And a little bit of concrete. Okay, um, so, workstation needs a crafting table. And it looks like it needs a chest, so there goes all of our wood. Um, but, oh, what? It needs to be an oak chest. Can I not, like, put the um, the thing in anyway? What? This, this, um, red concrete. Like, gray concrete? No? Okay. It has to be a normal chest. <sighs> Why does everything have to be difficult? Um, okay. I need to find oak wood. Oh, this place is made out of oak wood. Oh, I can probably just grab this chest anyway. Yeah, that's... Oh, I didn't even pick it up. Boop, boop. Perfect. Throw that away, too. Alright, we're speedrunning now. Boom. Workstation check. Um, I'm going to place this guy here. Okay, so now this is a cool interface. Requires the engine, requires the parts. Okay. So, ATV may be doable, but we actually want to at least... I, I want to try this one out first to see how hard it is to make. Um, where are we? It's right near the end, I believe. Here we go. Sofa copter. So, we have the ingots. We don't have the engine. We need a red couch and a ceiling fan. Um, so, what I'm going to do is probably look for some flax um, that has grown. So, up here we have a lot of canola. Down there we have our flax plants that we planted. Um, but that's not nearly enough. So, we'll, I mean, we'll replant them just in case that's all we've got. But I believe there are other farms here that have uh, flax growing in them. It's just a matter of... <laughs> finding them, I guess. 
All right, that farm down there does not have flax in it. Uh, it's not looking good in the flax department at all. Um, not at all. Ooh, here we go. There's a farm up here with the flax. I, I remember there was one, and so it was either we harvested it all, or there's flax there waiting for us somewhere. And here it is. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, I guess we got a little bit of coffee or whatever that was. Flax, flax. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, how much wool is that? Ooh, I think that's pretty good. Um, if not, we might just have to... We could even bone meal it or something and grow some more. But I think this should be fine. Let's make all of this into wool. Now, how much wool did I need for the sofa? We need a sofa. Couch, is it called? We need a red couch. So that is um, six red wool. So, am I able to do something like this? Uh, oh, with the red dye. Boo, 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 boo. I'll bring it all just in case I need to individually do them. Um, does this work? Oh, it does. Perfect. Ah, right, red wool. Ooh, what? Okay, scary spiders coming to kill me with baby spiders on their back. Yep, yep, we get it. This is horrific. Yep. I don't know why this exists. What? What the? What the? Okay, this is... This is horrific. This is just horrific. If, is it teleporting? What's happening? Okay. Okay. I really wish I had a gun on me. <laughs> so I could shoot myself. Um, okay. 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 Um, spiders. Not fun. Although we got spider eye. So I guess it, it delivered itself to us, which is pretty cool, but I'm still not a fan of it. <laughs> um, do I have food for my little dude here? Yeah, I got some raw mutton. Here you go, buddy. Yeah, yeah, come on. Oh, that was not enough. I want to heal my dog. Pork chops? Yeah, you want pork chops? Yeah, there we go. He's pretty He's pretty safe now. Okay, couch. Um, is that the couch? No, that's the couch. Boom, red couch. Um, now we need an engine. Is it called an engine or a motor? It's called an engine. Okay. Let's go for a wooden one. Um, oh, which engine do we want? I think it's this one. So we need two oak wood planks and a block of redstone. So let's get the block of redstone. Um, let's then empty our inventory of some of these things. Uh, probably this stuff. Next on the agenda, we need a bit of wood. So I'm going to pick this up because we need two planks. And now, we should be good to go to build this guy. Hopefully it's the right one, because I just built it without checking. Required electric engine. There we go. Okay. The red couch is checked. Um, we need a ceiling fan. Um, <laughs> a ceiling fan, huh? Ceiling fan, ceiling fan. So we need white concrete and block of redstone. So let's grab the white concrete out that we put away. Let's make another block of redstone. Perfect. And... Doo -doo -doo -doo. Ceiling fan. Check. Open this guy up. Craft. Oh, okay. Here we go. We have a vehicle crate. From Cray Industry. Industries. Um, I guess I'll just slap it down here. Right? No? Um, to open the crate, simply right-click on... Right-click the top with a wrench. But it doesn't place down. Right-click the top with a wrench. Huh. Alright, I'll be back. Uh, I guess when it's daytime and when I get... Oh, what? Okay, maybe I can't place it on this stuff. Okay, so I need a, a wrench now. I might move this as well, just in case it's in the way. Alright, let's find this wrench. Um, It is... Which one is it? Here we go. This wrench. Which actually looks like a wrench. Sort of. <laughs> I guess, not really. It kind of looks like a magnet. Um, A magnet on a stick. Let's uh, also have our dog sit down. Alright, here we go. Bam! Oh, that's a really cool animation. I quite enjoyed that. Okay. Here is our sofa copter. It has no fuel in it. <laughs> it needs fuel. Um, let's also check in controls. Um, Cray. Search by category. Cycle seats. Fart. And vehicle mod. Okay. So I need to power this guy some somehow with fuel. Oh. I'm holding it. 
<laughs> okay. Well. Okay. Um, so yeah, I need to fuel it. Uh, now I believe I saw, if I said fuel, um, there's fuel cans? Okay. Hopper, rose red, and ingots. I might actually just make that, because it doesn't seem too bad. Um, we're going to need a hopper, we're going to need rose red. I think I can use this to make a hopper. Um, so let's do this. Boom. Hopper, rose red, ingots gives us jerry can. Now it's empty. So... How do we fuel it? We need fuel <laughs> from um, Mr. Cray. All right, here we are. So it seems like, yeah, it needs fuelium. Use this jerry can to transport and fill vehicles with fuelium. It can hold the equivalent of five buckets of fuelium. Oh, so I could have just used a bucket, I think. Fuelium. You get it from fluid mixing, blaze juice, and ender sap. Oh, no. Is this going to be really difficult? Okay. And a bit of glowstone. Alright, let's bookmark the glowstone too. So, ender sap and blaze juice. Um, blaze juice, you get from fluid extracting a blaze rod. Which might be doable because we can turn um, blaze powder into blaze rods. The ender sap and ender pearl. Okay. <laughs> Alright, yeah. I mean, we can buy it. Ooh, okay. We can't buy any of this other stuff though, can we? This is what, iron, a little bit of stuff. Another blaze rod. Um, are the blaze rods... Can we buy these? No. So I am going to have to uh, use the blaze powder that we have. And compress it. Which means I'm going to need a bit more. Alright. I'm going to grab this gunpowder. Chuck it in here. I believe we can do two at a time. That should give us um, blaze powder. Yep. We got six. Which gives us a little bit more actually. Um, there's actually quite a bit of stuff I need to do to do this, so, how about, how about I try and figure out what we've got to do? <laughs> Alright, so what I need is a compactor, because with the compactor, um, here we go, we can turn five of our blaze powder into a blaze rod, and that should help us a lot. So we're going to need some bronze, which I think we have, some copper, this uses gold and redstone, um, a little bit of tin, four glass, we're going to need to uh, smelt up. And a piston. So let's see if we can do that. Do we have enough glass? Ooh, we, we do have enough sand. Alright, we actually already have enough uh, bronze. We have probably enough copper. Um, it looks like the tin we're going to have to uh, start crafting. Um, what do we have a lot of? This tin. Okay, and then we might need... Mm, we might not need anything else. Let's see how this goes. Alright, let me also make the hopper real quick. So we're going to need a chest put this here. Now, I think we need a few hoppers, but I will I guess I'll make them as we go. I didn't actually need to make a hopper. I, I meant to make a um, a piston. I don't, I don't know why I made a hopper, but we will need hoppers, so I guess that's somewhat fortunate. We'll put that away. Um, this guy, we're going to need a bit of gold. Do we actually have gold? We actually do have gold smelted, which is lucky. Um, we have a very messy inventory as well, which is not too fortunate. So here we go. Redstone reception coil. Make one of these. Um, hopefully, we have enough tin. I think we only needed a little bit. Um, let me split these up. Make sure we have everything smelting. The tiny coal is really good. Uh, you need to utilize that a lot in your early game. It's very, very helpful. Um, okay. We need this guy. The machine frame, which uses a tin gear. Some glass and some iron. Perfect. And then, can we make it? We need four copper... Uh, sorry, two copper gears that use uh, four copper each. There we go. And here we go. Compactor. Perfect. Place this guy connected to power. He'll charge up. We can chuck in our blaze. Um, we're going to need more blaze powder as we go. So hopefully this guy is charged up, which he is. So we can actually run up here. Open this guy. Chuck in our two gunpowder. Ignite it. Pick it up. And chuck it back in here. Perfect. Oh, we're going to get uh, three blaze rods. Beautiful. Wait for the first one and then we'll get crafting. Okay, believe it or not, it disappeared. I think it went into the coal generator. I, yeah, I'm pretty sure it went in the coal generator. So make sure you uh, configure your sides correctly because it does auto output if this is enabled, um, which obviously we didn't want, but it's, it's not the end of the world. All right. Um, all right, so we're going to make the brewing stand. Perfect. Next up, we need two hoppers. We already have one made. We also need more redstone. Ooh. We do have enough. Um, I'm not sure if we will have enough by the end of this, but, you know, for, for now we have enough. So, we got that going for us. 
So two hoppers. Um, we're going to need a block of redstone. There we go. And we have a fluid mixer. <sighs> does this guy need power? Oh, oh, oh. Um, it doesn't actually look like it does. It looks like he uses a, like, um, coal or something. So we're going to place this guy maybe over here. Maybe we'll put the, uh, the chopper over there. Pick this guy up and place him here. Oh, and I accidentally placed the torch. That's fine. Um, so fluid mixer is done. Now we need a fluid extractor, which is a piston, block of redstone, another bit of glass, which I think we have one glass. I think we might have just enough glass to get all this stuff done, which would be insane. So here we go. All right, let's uh, make the piston. Uh, so where are we? Fluid extractor, piston, we make that. Uh, next up, we're going to need a block of redstone. Make that. Our, oh, our glass should be done. We're placing torches everywhere. Uh, and here we go. Fluid extractor. Perfect. So, um, is that the input and that's the output? Oh, there's two inputs. So it looks like Blaze goes in here and Ender goes in there. So I'm going to place this guy maybe here. I don't know where he outputs. I don't, I don't even know if he does output. But, um, okay. How's this going to work? Let's grab our Blaze. Chuck it in here. And does it need fuel? Okay, yep. I guess it's working. We might have to just like bucket this or something. Or we could make fluid pipes. We'll see how this goes. The other thing is, um, this ender dust that we found when we were mining. Look at this. Ender pearl. How cool is that? So that is a very cool ore. So, oh, it didn't have enough fuel. Okay, we're going to have to bring out the big guns. Um, let's see. A stack of tiny coal. Surely that's enough. And we can see the exact amount it uses. I guess that'll help. Oh, and we can also just time in a bottle. So there we go. 450 blaze juice. Let's grab or I guess build um, a pipe. I'm also going to sleep through the night. You know what? We actually have the fluid ducts. Do you think that'll work? I, I hope it does. Let's place this guy right here. Okay. It, uh, it doesn't look like it's working. Um, so I guess it doesn't. Now, I don't know if there's like an actual output spot on this guy. Um, we'll try a different pipe. All right, so we're going to need gold ingots, a dropper, and a weighted pressure plate. We can do the weighted pressure plate. Um, we don't have enough gold ingots, so we'll do this. And I believe the dropper is just like a bit of redstone, right? Something like that. Let's go here, dropper. Yep, bit of redstone. And we should have our fluid extraction cable from a cyclic. Very powerful. Let's place this here. Yep, worked like a charm. Blaze juice in. Next, we want to uh, mine that up, put it on this side, and chuck in our ender pearl. Here we go. And we can speed this guy up. All right, you ready? This should get ender sap. Beautiful. Ooh, a bit more ender sap than blaze juice, but it should be fine. Now, let's put in our tiny coal in here. Oh, and we need a glowstone. I completely forgot about that. And we don't just magically have one, do we? No. Um, glowstone. How are we going to get a glowstone? Ooh, have a look at this. In our combustion that we have, we can combust two blaze powder and four redstone for this dust using this much heat unit. We can do that. That's, uh, that's very doable. Um, oh, we don't have enough redstone. I'm going to have to go mining for redstone. I mean, it's not the end of the world having to go mining for redstone. It's just, you know, it's a little bit... Yeah, All right, here we go. Let's blow this up. Get our blaze powder. Uh, put in some more tiny cold. Make sure we get the heat built up. And I guess uh, th that's the right amount, right? We need two. No, we need four. Okay, four redstone. We have none hiding around. We have this thing, which I don't know. You can magically turn into two redstone, which still isn't enough. All right, I'm going to go mining. I'll bring my luggage with, I guess. Make sure these guys don't have anything in them. Okay, I will meet you in the mines with hopefully some redstone. All right, we are in the mine. Um, I'm ex oh, actually, no, I mined up a lot of the redstone, didn't I? I was going to say, it shouldn't be too hard to find some redstone, but it might actually. So, we'll see how this goes. This pit, this hammer, by the way, the wub wub one, is ridiculous. Oh, I feel like I just saw some, didn't I? <gasps> yes! Okay, that is most definitely plenty. Oh, and look, here's more of that uh, ender ore, which I guess we'll mine. Might, might as well. No harm done. Alright, I'm going to take the redstone out of them. And be on my way. And we are back up. Okay, uh, these guys I'll pick up because they are 
quite annoying how they just run around everywhere. Let me put them away, even. Um, and here we go. So, inside here, I would like to put one, two, one, two, three, four. Close that. Ignite it. Walk over. Five glowstone. That is how it's done. Put a bit of glowstone in here. It will cook up. It has a really cool animation. And then... We have a bit of Fulium. Hey, that's pretty cool. Um, now, with the Fulium, can I just jerry can this? How do I... Gimme, gimme. Gimme. Hmm. Um, can I place it? Oh. No. Uh, not at all. Shift right click. Hold shift right click. No. Okay. Um, how am I going to get the fluid from this into like a tank or something? Alright, I'm going to try just making a tank and seeing if I can somehow do it that way. So we're going to get a basic fluid tank. Place this guy here. Does that somehow work? No. Nope. We'll um, place it here. See if this works. Okay, yep. The liquids are in here. Fulium. Holds Fulium. I mean, I guess it's not a full bucket, so do I have to make a full bucket's worth? I mean, it's doable. It's just, yeah, it's, you know, it's a little bit annoying. Uh, I guess I have to. Alrighty, time to make some magic. Uh, here we go. Let's speed this up as well. Do this, do this. Um, oh, did I grab it? I did. Let's also grab all this uh, ender dust and we'll probably use it all up. Here we go. So, we should see the blaze stuff finishing up. Yep, it's going in here. Um, oh, we can put our glowstone in. I think that might just be all we needed, to be honest. Because it uses, what, 200 at a time? Ooh. Yeah, see how this goes. Alright, that's done. Here we go. The ender pearls are now coming in. That is, that is going to be plenty. I already know. Let's uh, keep speeding this up. I would say that is perfect. Let's place it here. Fill this guy up. Two buckets worth. And yet, I still do not have this guy with any stuff in it. Input. Okay, I'm going to try with a bucket then. Okay, I've got a bucket of Fulium. How do I get it into this vehicle though? You know what I could try? I could try a gas pump. Do we think this would work? It uses quite a lot of iron though. I don't know if... I mean, I guess we'll, <laughs> we'll... We'll give it a shot, I guess. Alright, let's get a block of iron. What else do we need? Um, two blocks of iron. Oh, God. Here goes all our iron. Um, a bucket, which I've got an empty... Bu I've got a bucket here, so I guess I'll do this. See how that goes. Alright, fuel drum. Perfect. Um, it's highly explosive. Ooh, okay. Uh, we're going to need some redstone. Luckily, we seem to have enough. Barely, but, you know, enough. We need a dispenser, which uses um, a bow. Luckily, we do have the string. And I have some sticks on me, so... Here we go. Oh, I'm doing this the hard way, apparently. Where I go through every single recipe <laughs> to find it. Here we go. Dispenser. Gas pump. Let's come over here. Let's maybe, like, I don't know, place this down here. Fulium has zero in it. Let's make, I guess, another um, bucket. Pick up our Fulium. Run back over here. And right-click. Oh, okay. It's got 2% Fulium. Okay. Can I, like, um... Oh, no, that didn't work. Now, keep in mind... This was it was it said it was an electric engine. So I'm not sure if this even will work, right? 
Look at this. It is now empty. So that's that's the uh the gas thing. Oh, let's um put this back. Okay. Oh. <gasps> Look at this. You can see the fuel in the top left. And you can see it going down. It's you know it's going down, but it's not going down too fast. Look at this. The animation looks beautiful. You can see my cool boots. Oh my god. Look at this. You know what would be really cool in this mod? Uh, like a... Um, what do you call it? A TARDIS. Because it kind of has that like uh, animation that you always see in Doctor Who where it like... You know, it sort of like tilts on its side as it flies through. I like this. This is really cool. I, I mean... I think this is it. I think... Oh, can I hold a gun while I'm up here? Oh! Alright. Uh, reminder not to shift, I guess. Can I get in? I can. Can I hold it? I can! <laughs> Wait, can I shoot? Oh my god! So I can fly. I can do drive-bys. Um, I don't know how to go lower without... Um, oh, control. Control goes lower. I guess that makes sense. Let's see. Oh, here's some spiders. This is what I think of you. Yeah. I don't even know if it's working. I might be shooting my own, uh... <laughs> my own vehicle. I like this. I, I, I'm very happy with, uh... This mod pack and how, how it turned out. Now, keep in mind, we're, we were sort of just building things as we went. Sort of, uh, doing our own thing. Which is how the mod packs are meant to be, play, meant to be played. It said it was a kitchen sink pack with just a bunch of mods. Do it how you will. Um, but... It also does have this quest book. So, if you are lost, you can go through here. And there are quite a lot of stuff here. There's stuff to do with, um... Uh, reactors and all that. So you can know where you want to aim for. A whole bunch of machines for space. Um, you can see a bunch of, uh, you know, different things. Cobble generators to help you out. Some boss battles. Different storages. Machines. Mystical agriculture. All the fun stuff. And obviously, s some of these, I don't know if they open up more than they currently do. Because uh, with this page, for instance. Oh, we almost got hit. Oh, we actually hit him. Um, with this page, for in instance, it was empty except for, uh, like, one welcome thing. So, I clicked this, and the other quest showed up. So, there could be more of that. I'm, I'm not too sure. There might not be, but either way, there's quite a lot of quests. So, that's pretty cool. Oh, we are under a under attack by se seemingly skeletons. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching. If you did enjoy, please do consider subscribing. Also, make sure you go and check out the mod pack. Uh, it should be in the description below. Give some advice, give some tips, or download it and play yourself. So, you can fly around and... And have some fun. It's been pretty stable. Um, the frame rate's been pretty good, as you can see. It's been at the top of the screen the whole time. Um, it hasn't crashed on me. So that's pretty positive as well. Um, so yeah, all, all seems to be pretty good. No real bugs that I've encountered, as, as far as I recall. Um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.